Georg von Sodenstern was a German general in the Wehrmacht during World War II who commanded the 19th Army. He was also a recipient of the Knight's Cross of the Iron Cross of Nazi Germany. Born on November 15, 1889, in Kassel, Germany, von Sodenstern joined the 3rd Upper Silesian Infantry Regiment, number 62, as an ensign on March 13, 1909. He was promoted to lieutenant on January 27, 1910, and went into World War I with his regiment as a company officer. On February 25, 1915, he was promoted to Oberleutnant, and on August 18, 1917, he was promoted to captain. After the First World War, von Sodenstern joined the Reichswehr and deployed in the 27th Infantry Regiment. He then became a company commander in the 6th Infantry Regiment. In 1924, he was transferred to Kassel as a staff officer for Group Command 2. In 1925, he joined the General Staff of Infantry Leader 3 in Potsdam. In 1926, he was transferred to the Army Organization Department in Berlin. The following year, he was assigned directly to the Troops Office and was promoted to Major on February 1, 1928. In 1931, he was appointed Adjutant to the Chief of the Troop Office. He was promoted to Lieutenant Colonel on October 1, 1932 and Colonel on September 1, 1934. On October 15, 1935, von Sodenstern took over as commander of the newly formed 65th Infantry Regiment in Delmenhorst. He resigned in August 1937 and became Chief of Staff of the 6th Army Corps in Munster. After being promoted to Major General on March 1, 1938, von Sodenstern became Chief of the General Staff at Group Command 2 on December 1, 1938. He then became Chief of Staff of Army Group C under Wilhelm Ritter von Lieb, which was responsible for defending the western border during the invasion of Poland. On February 1, 1940, he was promoted to General Lieutenant, and on August 1, 1940, he was promoted to General de Infanterie. Due to Gerd von Rundstedt's appointment as Commander-in-Chief West in October 1940, von Sodenstern remained active in the West until early 1941. At the beginning of the attack on the Soviet Union on June 22, 1941, he became Chief of the General Staff of Army Group South and served under von Rundstedt, Walter von Reichenau and Fedor von Bock. When the Army Group was divided up for the forthcoming summer offensive in early July 1942, he was appointed Chief of Staff of Army Group B under Maximilian von Weichs. In July 1943, he was transferred to the Führer Reserve. On August 13, 1943, he was reactivated and in the West became Supreme Commander of Army Group Felber, from which he raised the 19th Army. In this function, he was responsible, among other things, for the German measures in the Italian occupation area in southern France when Italy left the war. At the end of June 1944, von Sodenstern was replaced by Friedrich Wieser and left the Wehrmacht with honor. Post-military from 1946, he worked on studies on the Second World War as part of the German Department of the United States Army's war history. From 1954, Sodenstern presided over a working group for defense research as a figurehead, with Jürgen Rover actually doing the work. Sodenstern died on July 20, 1955, in Frankfurt am Main. Awards and decorations included the Iron Cross, both classes, the Cross for Merit in War, the Austrian Military Merit Cross, and the Knight's Cross of the Iron Cross on July 19, 1940, as General Lieutenant and Chef de Generalstabs, Peres Group A. He also received the German Cross in Gold on January 2, 1943. Georg von Sodenstern's military career spanned over three decades, from his early days as an ensign in the 3rd Upper Silesian Infantry Regiment, number 62, to his final position as Supreme Commander of Army Group Felber. Throughout his career, he held various positions, including Company Commander 
regimental commander, and chief of staff for several army groups. His military service was marked by several promotions, including those to lieutenant, captain, major, lieutenant colonel, colonel, major general, and general der Infanterie. Von Sodenstern's role in World War II was significant, particularly in the early years of the war. He played a key part in the invasion of Poland and the subsequent campaigns in the West and the East. His leadership skills and strategic thinking were instrumental in the success of several military operations, including the Battle of France and the Battle of Stalingrad. After the war, von Sodenstern worked on studies related to the Second World War, contributing to the historical record of the conflict. He also presided over a working group for defense research, focusing on the military aspects of the war. His work in this area helped to shed light on the complexities and nuances of the war, providing valuable insights for future generations of military leaders and historians. In conclusion, Georg von Sodenstern was a highly decorated and accomplished German general who played a significant role in World War II. His military career spanned over three decades, during which he held various positions and played a key part in several major military operations. His post-war work on the Second World War helped to contribute to a deeper understanding of the conflict and its impact on the world. Thank you for watching, and if you enjoyed this video, please subscribe and share it. Your support is greatly appreciated, and you can find details on how to support my channels through PayPal in the description box below.